Many of you custom lure makers might be wondering, how do you put eyes on a crankbait, jerkbait, or any other custom lure I paint? My lure didn't come with any eyes, so how am I supposed to have a finished lure, say this jerkbait right here, without eyes? I mean, don't you have to have eyes to have a successful bait? And the answer is yes. Well, I guess you could sort of catch fish without eyes, but they'd have to be stupid fish, like bluegills, because bluegills are dumb. Okay, but anyways, so here's how to put light or uh, eyes. I can't speak. Here's how to put eyes on your crankbait, jerkbait, custom lure that you painted. So when you order your lure, say off of Dinger Custom Baits or eBay or Amazon, um, it most likely won't come with eyes unless it's like some special kind, like a whopper plopper. It'll come with those special eyes or like a little John, you know, it'll come with those little um, crescent eyes. But if it's a normal jerkbait like this, you've got your circle eye hole right there. Now, how am I going to put eyes in there? Well, you're going to go on Amazon and search um, custom lure eyes or fishing lure eyes. It's going to pop up. And if you're looking for certain prices, a cheap one is going to be one like this. Looks just like that. You got... Looks just like that. You got small eyes up here, medium-sized eyes. Uh, a little bit bigger than the medium size eyes and then the large eyes so now what you got to do is you got to match it up so do these tiny eyes match no do these medium ones match no do these middle ones match no so that means this large one's going to fit right in there perfectly see that see the medium and the large the large looks like it's going to be a perfect fit so what you want to do you want to take the wrapper off this Take the wrapper off, and then you'll have it open like this. But I've already used some of the eyes on this. So this is a Baby Bess um, jerkbait with the black top, green with some little triangles right here, and then the white belly. Baby Bass. so you got to think about your colors. Do I want to use red? Does red look good with green and black? Does that look realistic? No. Does green? Yes, this is... A green jerk bait. You want to do greenish yellow eyes. So these ones would be the perfect ones right here. So then, how do you put them on? This is what you do. Take your Elmer school glue. Right there. Just put a little tiny bit on the eye. Like that. So now here's what you want to do. Take your eye off of the right color. In this case, the lime green. Uh, yellowish color with your glue there fit it right in and just drop it on top like that and push it in a little bit now some glue might get on it what should I do with glue as you can see there's a little glue right there excess glue to do to fix that just take a little piece of toilet paper or paper towel or whatever you got near you maybe a washcloth a rag just dab on it a little bit. No, not like that. Dab on it. Like, dab it with the paper towel. And there you go. You got the eye in uh, the right way. So when this glue dries, it'll be clear and it'll just look uh, normal. So turn it around to the other side. What do I do now? Well, it's a circle eye. Just take it out, put some glue on it again. Take your eye off of the same color. Place it right on. Push it in. And boom, you're done with eyes. One eye, two eye. Now you just let these dry, and then you'll clear coat them later, and it'll cement those eyes right in. When you brush that clear coat over it, it'll cement the eyes in so they're not coming out. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I try to help you guys out with tutorials like this. Nice and short one, just teaching you how to put eyes in on your custom lure. 
Or maybe you lure like a Rapala or like a KVD. I popped out, what do I do? Order these, peel them off, glue them on, clear coat it. That's it guys. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Please subscribe. Uh, we're on the road to 175 subscribers. That's going to be awesome when we hit there. And we just have to look towards the future. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.